Here's Hugh Maid again, your expert trainer from Exercise TV, and I'm here to answer a few more questions that were posted on the blog. Okay guys, so um, back, I'm back under the blog here, and the next question is from Sarah. She says, hi, I have a question about aerobic exercise versus anaerobic. She says, I've done some research on the two exercises, but I'm still unsure um, which one I'm doing. And she says, I use the free videos on Exercise TV's website, and I'm not sure whether they're aerobic or not. So that's great. First of all, I'm glad you're using all the free videos on Exercise TV. And to answer the question, um, odds are you're gonna be in the aerobic phase. For most of our workouts on a daily basis, we stay in the aerobic phase. Aerobic means with oxygen, and anaerobic means without oxygen. Well, okay, so what does that mean, really? Um, well, it's a little complicated. Basically, it's just two different forms of workouts. It's, your body is working out in a different way. For aerobic, that's where you're in like a moderate intensity zone. You're not at, like your max heart rate either. You're kind of in a, a medium zone. And for the most part, that's where most of your workouts are gonna be. So when you're doing an exercise TV video or your normal workouts, odds are you're gonna be in the aerobic zone for most of that. Now the anaerobic part is the really short intervals that really, really spike your heart rate where they're like short blasts of intensity. So think like sprints or when you're cranking out a bunch of push-ups or doing some really, really hard weight training, then your body goes into that anaerobic zone. Now the anaerobic zone can only hold it for a couple minutes, but it's really good to, um, to give your body some power and some strength. It's gonna strengthen your muscles, um, and it's, it's really good to get your heart rate up there and blast your calories for a few minutes at a time. So you wanna have a little bit of both, and odds are you probably do. During a video workout, most of the time you're in your aerobic zone, but if you're doing some little short intervals in there that spike your heart rate, your body's gonna switch over into the anaerobic zone. But that's it for today, guys. Um, I hope I was able to help you out a little bit. Remember, if you've got any questions for me, just post them on the blog. You can post them actually right under this video um, on the blog, or you can also look um, on Exercise TV's Facebook fan page whenever we talk about Ask the Expert, or if you see me on there, just shoot me a message. I'm on there every day, and just let me know if you have any questions, and I'll get to them next time.